What time was he supposed to be out here? <laughs> they didn't knock on the door. No, it's too big. <laughs> <laughs> they forgot we were sitting here, huh? That's how they do it. They walk by and heard it. Somebody got me good. What up, one man, one vision? That shit is off the hook. Right. Y'all better go subscribe to Six Eye because that last trailer. <laughs> Thank you, bro. That shit is lit. <clears throat> um, even though you weren't supposed to put that, I was in there flirting with them mans. Mr. Sappho gonna get you. <laughs> so yes, I'm gonna answer your question because you guys said. Because I said, my son do a lot of things, but one thing he don't do is lie. I didn't raise no liars. Now, some pimps, maybe. <laughs> but I ain't raised no liars. So, somebody said in the comments, is everything he said about you true or was them lies? <laughs> I was a hoe. <laughs> I was definitely a hoe. <laughs> ho, 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 mother... <laughs> he ain't lie. <laughs> I'm a reformed hoe. Okay, I got my papers. I got my get out of jail free card, bitch. I ain't a hoe no more. So it might have been true back in the day. So there was some truth to it. Ho, 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 motherfucker. But I ain't no hoe no more. So to answer your question, no, ma'am, he didn't lie on me. <laughs> he just wasn't supposed to snitch on me. But um, no, ma'am, he ain't lie. I'm a reformed hoe, bitch. I done went to church, been born again, certified, saved, okay? The whole days is way behind me. They're beneath me. So when he called me a garden tool, he was he was calling me my spirit from back in the day, okay? <laughs> but no, ma'am, I ain't no hoe no more. So ho, 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 mother. What was your if he ain't no liar? Why was he lying when he called you a hoe? <laughs> no, <laughs> but I ain't no hoe no more. So, what's up? What's up? What's up, guys? Welcome to Vet City News Desk. I'm your host, Alastin Mandela. And I'm sorry, guys, it has been long since you know I've posted some content on this channel. That's because you know I was away for some you know meeting, and but I am back, and you know, we are going to do it bigger and better this time guys remember we told you we we're on the road to 5000 subscribers and currently we are at 1500 subscribers so each and every time you watch our videos and feel entertained don't forget to hit that subscribe button don't forget to like our videos and don't forget to share so that we can be recommended you know to a larger audience out there so you know on the news just reaching our desk there has been you know this conversation on x you know between blueface and uh, Cardi B's husband offset, you know, after Blueface just going out on his ex account, you know, to accuse uh, Christian Rock for, you know, smashing with Cardi B's husband offset. And, you know, offset couldn't keep his silence, you know, after Blueface just coming out and, you know, accusing him of, you know, smashing with Christian Rock. He came out to defend himself, saying that he has never talked or even touched Christian. So offset, you know, should stop accusing him of all this, you know. Uh, accusations and you know she'll stop using his name you know for false accusation because so in some way you know offset felt so offended for bluefers just coming out and saying that you know offset smashed with christian rock also christian rock came out you know on twitter on her ex saying that you know uh, bluefers just making some stuff up because you know she feels bad because christian has moved on from him you all know that christian yesterday went ahead and you know covered up you know the whole tattoo of bluefers that was on her neck with a rose flower. So uh, Blueface has been, you know, feeling offended, saying that, you know, Christian has decided, you know, to move on with and focus on her new relationship. And, you know, he just came out and, you know, posted on his account, you know, saying that Christian on November 10th at 4 a.m. morning, you know, smashed with Offset, you know, in Offset's home in Los Angeles. And saying that he has proven, you know, if they still they continue to deny it, he's going to share and leak, you know, the whole proof for the whole world to see it. And, you know, among the people that have come out to react on this whole story include Blueface's mom, Kalisha. And, you know, she just came out to give her own view about, you know, the ongoing exchange on X account between, you know, Blueface and Offset, you know, Blueface saying that, you know, Offset went ahead and smashed Christian Rock. 
and say call he even he went to her head and called Christian Rock a house saying that you know he doesn't you know feel appreciated by the fact that you know his face is still tattooed on a horse neck and you know and he's going out there smashing everyone else and I guess Bluefest just felt hurt, you know, because we all know that he has always had feelings for Christian Rock, despite, you know, him going ahead and proposing to Jaden Alexis a couple of months ago. The according to Christian, she came out and revealed that, you know, the two were still hanging out and you know, they have been smashing despite Bluefest being in a relationship with Jaden Alexis. And she even went ahead and said that, you know, her and Bluefest were locked in for life and you all remember one a week ago, you know, when Bluefest just pulled up at Christian Rock home in four at four AM in the morning, you know, and found Junior alone with you know Christian's friend. So this was just bringing up question and you know uh justifying the fact that, you know, why was Bluefest, you know, at Christian's home in the first place at four AM? It made you know people prove that, you know, they were still together with Christian Rock and behind all the online, you know, trolling and everything, the two were still smashing and even seeing each other. So Kalisha just came out, you know, to comment on about the whole story about, you know, Christian smashing with Offset. And you all know that you know Kadi B and Offset have also been having the uh, worst experiences of late in their relationship and even Kadi B coming out and saying that she's currently single and all that. And even she said that Offset cheated on him, but she never mentioned it already. But now Bluefers just coming out and saying that it was Christian that smashed with Offset. Then maybe it may be the reason why, you know, Cardi B and Offset have been having these wrangles in a couple of days. So tell us in the comment section what you think, guys, about, you know, Bluefest coming out and accusing Christian Rock, you know, for smashing with Offset, do you think that this story is true or is just Bluefest you know, trying to remain relevant after, you know, Christian moving on and even going ahead and, you know, doing away with the whole tattoo, Bluefest, you know, first tattoo on her neck. So tell us what you think in the comments, in the comments section and don't forget to like and share this video, guys. Remember, we thank you so much for your support and we have always been looking forward, you know, to 5,000 subscribers before the end of the year, guys. I know we have stayed for more than five days without posting, but... We hope that, you know, you shall be here to support us because we are back and we're going to close the year with some amazing content. So don't always forget to support us. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.